Hello and welcome back. My name is Andrew Coleman, and this is What's Your Passion number 48, Winning Transformations. And I attended an interesting webinar here on Wednesday night. It was quite late my time from 10 p.m. to a little bit past midnight. They were still going strong at about 12.25 when I dropped out of the session. But it was very interesting. And one of the best slides in the uh, entire session and presentation was this slide that we see here about 90% or 96% of Lean Six Sigma uh, efforts are failing. And they had done quite a bit of uh, investigation across a lot of industries to gather this data. Uh, they cite it in their uh, package that they had for the webinar. And you'll notice it goes down very quickly. 78% year one are still active, but that means 22% don't even make it past the first year. That's a, that's a lot. That's one in five. <laughs> that's amazing. Uh, second year, it's already 40% are out. By third year, half are gone. By fourth year four, almost three fourths are no longer doing what they set out to do. And by the fifth year, you're down to 4%. And we see this is mirrored, not just in Lean Six Sigma world. This is right across the spectrum. We, we see very similar uh, results in the agile transformation area. And we've talked about uh, a lot of the reasons why that happens. And so in today's blog post, you'll want to dive in and take a look at that. I've put the link here in the description on YouTube. How do we transform people into winners with the right attitudes? And I'm quoting some quotes from Zig Ziglar, and he talks about the inputs that we're putting into our mind that you have, if you want to have the right attitude, you have to look at the inputs. It's logical. It makes sense. But this seems lost on most people. And I would say that this is one of the fundamental reasons why transformations fail. So if you want to dive deeper into the topic, uh, click the link in the description here on YouTube and check out my blog post today. I think you'll find a lot of good information in there. I walk you through a little bit about the 4R model and I link you to several other blog posts from that blog post, which address all of the items that we see here on this slide that pretty much tells the whole story. This has been What's Your Passion, number 48, Winning Transformations. My name is Andrew Coleman, and I look forward to chatting with you again.